smoke? I do. The kind you like. Now where's the amber? Fortunately, it's not on me at the moment. And you really should be telling me... What a good job I did. Busted my ass and managed to hide it right before I got caught. Which... Is why I'm still alive. The deal was... We get you out of here when you deliver the Amber. No Amber, no protection, Luis. <laughs> Such a stickler for details, Halida. Huh, <laughs> okay, then. I'll go get it now, how about that? I do have something else I need to get, too. What the hell is the Amber? This is Roost. I've got some bad news, Condor One. With the weather like this, the chopper can't make its approach. What? Can stand by until it clears? Negative. Too dangerous. We're gonna get out of here and find someplace safe. I'm sorry. I wish I could do more to help. Don't worry about it. We'll swim home if we have to. Condor one out. Let's go. That's a stupid change. What's, what's gonna happen to me? Lay right down. Let's just focus on getting out of here. Yeah. Right. Can I go talk to my merchant friend? Yeah. So in the original game, she's like, "Yeah, we sent a chopper, but it got shot down." Leon's like, "Oh shit, that makes sense." In this game, they're like, eh, the weather's too bad. We can't send it after the president's daughter because of the weather. Bitch, you've got choppers worth $8 billion. I know, because you take it out of my taxes every fucking check. You better send that fucking chopper. Jesus. Can't handle a little rain? Are you kidding me? Right, so chapter 5 is in the bag, guys. And, uh, wow. We... We chewed through a lot of resources getting through that, uh, <laughs> that segment. Look at this. So we've got the TMP with the stock. God, this takes even more space than it used to, I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure it used to be 2x2. Two two. Now it's 2x3. Seriously? And it doesn't even line up right <laughs> with the gun. This looks like ass. I'm sorry, I'm grumpy about this. I miss my laser sight. God damn it. They ruined... They didn't ruin it. Like, I think it's still a good gun. But it doesn't feel as good to use now. And that just makes me a sad long couch. Makes me very sad. Well, let's, uh... Finish... Organizing. We don't really have much to organize. This will be fine for now. Should really get the handgun reloaded. I will say I did really enjoy that cabin sequence. I think that's generally improved. I like being able to board up the windows. I am sad that we never got a chance to go back and loot the house. Because we can't go back, right? That's always something I enjoyed doing in the OG. Once you finish that sequence, you can actually go back and loot everything you missed. I tried to loot as we went. But I'm sure there are things that I missed. So it just sucks that you can't go back. Oh well. Moving on then. I've actually been really, really curious about how they're going to handle this chapter. This could end up really sucking. Okay, we've looped around. There's the merchant. That's good. Let me see about... Looting things out here first. Just so I know what my inventory is going to look like before I talk to him. Then we got a door up there. Okay. How about any errant treasures laying around out here? Don't see anything like that. Okay. And do we have anything to combine? I still haven't picked up another yellow gem. Maybe I can get that... 
with spinels right now. I never use these last wooden planks. It's telling me I can sell these, though. <laughs> Apparently, we won't need those anymore. Okay. Good to know. Submachine gun ammo. Let's go ahead and get that reloaded. Okay. I have some new goods that might interest you. Oh, really? Merchant tip, midnight stroll. You ever seen those nasty guys with the tentacles sprouting out of their heads? Not only are they dangerous, but they're a pain to kill, too. Yeah, tell me about it. They do have a weakness, though. They absolutely hate bright lights like the sun. That's why you won't see them out during the day. <laughs> so if you ever go for a walk during the night, it'd be wise to keep some flash grenades handy. Hell, I keep a couple on me at all times. You can make some yourself using the recipe I am selling, if you're interested. Yeah, I already bought that. Speaking of being out at night, we uh, need to check and see if the merchant's eyes glow now that it's nighttime. <laughs> and he's very shy. He doesn't want to really give you a good look, but you can just kind of see them there. And it looks like his eyes don't glow anymore. So they've really changed a lot about the merchant in this game. Not just his voice, which was bad enough, but you also can't kill him. <laughs> Maybe you can on the harder difficulty mode. Hmm, yeah, that'd be an interesting thing to try. But also, his eyes don't glow at night anymore, so you don't have this creeping suspicion that he is actually Plagueis infected. Welcome. I got something new for you. Yeah, it's just weird. All right, well, we'll sell the wooden planks Ruby's for five hundred. Makes no difference. The price, well, that's our choice to make. Thank you. Whoops. Nope. We don't want to sell that. Whoa, what? Dude, are you, you bullshitting me? Bang for your buck. I guarantee it. Yo, check it out, guys. We got the riot gun available already. I was not expecting this. A semi-automatic shotgun with a tight spread, making it effective at longer distances. Dude, that's crazy. This isn't supposed to be here yet. And I can't afford it. How much can I sell the skull shaker for? Oh, yeah. 46,000. Yeah, that's gonna happen right now. This is gonna take a lot more space in the inventory, but luckily we've just cleared it out, so... <laughs> Thank you. This actually works out kind of okay. No space. Uh, I mean, we can make space. That Come on. cash in your pocket or your life. Easy choice, mate. <laughs> Would you rather have your money or your life? Uh, this is going to be a pain in the nards to make space for. Our case is not quite big enough to fit everything on the left as I like it. Suppose we could move this. Uh, oh jeez. Okay, I'm going to have to do some serious work here. Hold on a second. Okay, time to buy this. Your inventory is full, you must make space in your attachment case. Where are you case. gonna put this? Your pocket? Oh, I was really hoping this would fit in this way, and it doesn't. Oh, I feel like this is bigger than it used to be. That's what she said. like this. Okay, this is what we've come up with for now. It's not super ideal, but it'll work for now. Ah, that there's a real boomstick, mate. It will reduce your target to a bloody pulp. It better. That thing takes so much more space than it used to. I mean, in reality, it's probably only two, maybe four extra spaces. But... Your weapons are in good hands, mate. I'll see you right. I'm surprised my knife doesn't need any repairs, but I will also take it. And then I've got 31,000 pesetas left over. Well, we're going to start pouring that right into this guy. <laughs> Let's see. Ammo capacity is already at seven. That's great. That's going to feel really good. Rate of fire... See, it's so weird how rate of fire and reload speed go up in this game. They used to go down. 
<laughs> and it breaks my brain because I don't know what the frame of reference is. The rate of fire, I guess, is the number of shots it can fire per second. Whereas it used to be the number of seconds between shots. So it's kind of the opposite of how it used to be. And then reload speed, I guess, is only actually changing the number of rounds you load at a time. I don't know, man. It's weird. It's weird the way they did this. But, uh, hey, let's get the power up. This kind of work is about finesse, stranger. Little bit goes a long way. You'll see. And then with the ammo capacity of seven, I think we're probably going to want reload speed. Knife needs care every once in a while. Dazzled, are you? <laughs> Our craftsmanship demands no less. Okay. Oh, look, we can What's buy gunpowder here. How have we procured these curiosities? <laughs> Come back anytime. Merchant, you talk too much. I'm sorry. That's just how I feel. Oh, look, they automatically added the right gun where my skull shaker used to be. Okay. This gun better not piss me off. <laughs> it very well could. My expectations have been thwarted more than once already with the way they've handled the guns in this game okay let's see what we're walking into here we've got company keep moving but quietly got it okay oh i'll try quietly says leon let's see if we can get some stealth kills guys i think that's going to be He's going to turn around instantly, isn't he? Yep. Stealth is going to be the way to go, I think, because... Man, we, uh... We are running low on supplies. Good start. Who the hell saw me? Oh man, they have raised the alarm already. Well, okay. Hey, there's that yellow diamond I've been wanting. Run, Ashley. Come on back this way. Another bull guy. Jesus. All right, get down. Shit. Man, you whiff that first headshot. <laughs> I tried to parry that, but I think I was just too late in general. It just wasn't going to happen. I need to get everybody in front of me. Oh. Let her go. Ooh, hey, I actually dodged this guy. Oh no, bear trap! Jesus Christ! Ah! Oh. <laughs> okay. Here, eat riot gun. Douchebags. I am literally on fire. Oh my god. On Ashley. What? She just walked right over that. Okay, see, now they're just bullshitting me. Okay, yep, but I can I can get caught in it. What's the point of luring them over the bear traps if it doesn't fucking work? bitch. Alright. Let's go back up here. Big difficulty spike, guys. Hey, you. Any chance I could get you to stop throwing fire at me? 
sure would appreciate it. Alright, well at least I got some herbs. That'll come in handy. Rikon did seem to make short work of the bull guy, so I am grateful for that at least. Man, this area is very claustrophobic. I'm not 100% sure, like, what zone they're emulating right now. Ashley. Oh my god! Okay, somehow she got hit up there. There, thank god. This, uh, semi-auto rifle starting to give me grief. I feel like my aim got worse for some reason. I don't know how that happened. Wait, where the hell did you go? Oh, she got back up. Hmm. I wonder if she gets up automatically after you kill everybody in the area. That must be what happened there. Okay. I wasn't even really paying attention to what all I picked up. Let's see, we got two herbs. Might as well go ahead and combine those straight away. Okay, yeah, we're not doing super hot on ammo. But that's okay. We'll survive. I have faith in myself. I don't have faith in myself to keep avoiding these bear traps, though. Fucking things are everywhere. Alright, let's look for treasure. Ashley sounds like she's having a rough time. I am super glad that we don't have to keep giving her healing items in this version of the game. See, there's a good change. <laughs> All of my healing is for me. And me alone. Okay. Before I forget, let's go ahead and combine these. Twenty-two thousand eight hundred. Not bad. I'm going to try to hang on to my explosive bolts, by the way. I'm actually really curious about whether the damage upgrade to the bolt thrower works on the explosive ones, too. Dude, that's creepy. Look at that. Oh, man, that's some really great imagery right there. Oh shit! I didn't see that guy there! <laughs> um... Oh, you're gonna turn, aren't you? Yeah. It feels like 80% of them turn. That's probably not actually accurate, but... <laughs> it feels that way. What were you protecting? The Chalice of Atonement. Ooh, this needs three gemstones. Oh, they're going to be waiting a while for that. <laughs> a cup dedicated to those toiling for their past transgressions. There are three rectangular recesses around it. Yep. Yeah, I mean, I have like six of these red ones. I might actually have to start using them. So they're like... They're the smallest value. And I started to figure, like, why ever use these when I can just wait until I get more valuable gemstones, you know? But I don't really know how many they give you throughout the whole course of this game. You might have to use some of the weaker ones. And in that scenario, I guess it makes sense to use them on the ones with the least amount of, uh, you know... What's the word? Definitely gonna catch a cold. 
That'll be the least of your problems, actually. <laughs> you know, the treasures with the least amount of holes to put things into. I couldn't think of a better way to word that. I'm sorry. So I was kind of expecting a choice here about which path to take. And it kind of looks like they're just going to throw me into a single path. So as most of you probably know, in the original game, you can choose between a path with another El Gigante or a path with a crapload of Ganados, including some chainsaw ladies. Sure is quiet. I feel like here they're just throwing me into the chainsaw lady path. And I also think I should craft some more shotgun shells. I think that is a wise decision. What can I do with this? We can do uh, TMP ammo. Sold. Give it to me. So I'll tell you, that Bella sister fight, <laughs> that's the name of the Chainsaw Ladies. I don't use their names very often because I played this game so much before I even knew what their names were. <laughs> I just grew accustomed to calling them Chainsaw Guy and Chainsaw Lady. It's just kind of stuck in my crawl, you know? But yeah, they are not an easy fight. I'll tell you that much. Okay. This seems like an area where we're going to have to fight a shitload of them. It's just a question of when they're going to pop out. Oop. Okay. We got one way down there. Sure are chatty. Oh, did she see me? Oh, now they saw me. Damn it. Fucker. That initial headshot, man, is so hard to hit sometimes. Get him! No. Ooh, yellow herb! Oh, but see, now I don't have a green herb to use it with. That was helpful. <laughs> oh, I need to be pulling off some more of that. kind of wish that the Ashley command button was on something besides R3 because I think I am occasionally hitting it by accident. It also kind of feels like maybe it doesn't really matter that much. Huh. Won't open. Oh, great. <laughs> the commands are so nebulous, you know. It's like, eh, hang out here or hang out there. Either way, you're going to be getting in trouble. So, who really cares? Hmm, okay. Let's take a look up high. Look for any... treasure things. Not seeing much. Everybody is so noisy in this game. Ashley sounds like she's constantly out of breath. <laughs> All the Ganados are always like, I'm a habit, da da da. 
Ibakaribaka. Just constantly talking shit that I can't understand. Oh, here we Wait go. Here. What? Yeah, get in there. Okay. I'd rather you be in there than out here getting caught. I was wondering if they were going to bring back that mechanic. Oh, I can make a full mixture now. Thank you, Lord Jesus. What else we got out here? Oh, it's another one of these. A way shrine. I how many of these there are. Elegant headdress. Thanks. Uh, how do we get down to that area with the locked door? Is it down here? I'm not sure what's down here, actually. Uh, no. That was not the same area. Where even am I now? Okay, that area is over here. Yeah, this is what we want. Now, I really hope that Ashley is just safe in that locker. <laughs> She's just gonna stay there until I yell for her. And I'm not gonna do that until I have cleared out this entire frickin' zone. Whatever they're gonna throw at me, I'll deal with it first, and then she can come out. Although, you know, she did help me out with that one call-out. I'll give her that. Um, okay, that leads down to nowhere. That's downstairs. What's out this way? Um, is this that same spot? It is. I don't need to drop down there. Okay. So from here, we're going down. 